lifted a 21 foot fish house onto our roof yesterday. And today we're ready to try some fishing. We have transformed our roof into a classic Minnesota winter scene and we have three holes ready for fishing. There's also going to be a second fish house for warming up and an ice curling sheet as well in addition to a four wheeler. We're going to show you a little bit more of that through the course of the next couple days and some surprises as well. So stay tuned for that. That fishing fundraiser there is now officially underway. Yeah, Mark Rosen is in the fish house with some special gifts. Guests, Rosie, we're excited to meet your he special guests. We got guest. another one, Amelia. Oh, come Can't on. You see? Look at that. Are you kidding? He just got another one. Well, now, is that touch. already on the end of the line? Amelia, come this, on is, now, Rosie. this was all legit. Come on. <laughs> uh, listen, uh, every time a fish is caught just like this, a donation will be made to ACES, and this is what it is all about. Khalida Ali is with me, who uh, has been part of the ACES Foundation uh, as a student. This is a fourth grade. He moved here from Ethiopia, and uh, this is fantastic. I can't tell you how passionate I am about this organization and why you should donate. It is the, one of the best things I've ever been involved with. All the sports teams are involved, and I want to ask you, first of all, um, what kind of impact ACES has made on your life, Khalid? Uh... I, mean, I had a lot of impact with ACES. They had, they helped me understand, like, uh, be emotionally with, uh, understand students, like, get help. Uh, I get help with homework, and I get to like learn English when I before the first time I got here. And yeah, you knew yeah, no English when no, you got here. No, it was hard. But right after, uh, right after I got enrolled at Linwood Monroe, I joined ACES. And uh, right. Yeah. It combines uh, math and sports. In fact, I think when you were in fifth grade, part of the after-school tutoring program involved taking a sports broadcasting class and being a soccer fan, football yeah. fan in Ethiopia. That was something you were really interested in. Yeah, I mean, I knew about uh, soccer a lot. I watched soccer a lot, so it was easier for me to tell the students about soccer than they tell me English, then I just tell that. And, and now you're on the advisory, youth advisory, so you're helping other kids follow yeah. in your footsteps. Yeah. I mean, it helped me prepare for high school, so I'm yeah. like, why can't I help them? And you're doing so well at St. Paul Central. We're very proud of you. You know, I love you, man. It's, right. it's great to have you up here. One of my favorite guys. And this is why we want to make these phones ring and ring and ring. It's just a wonderful program for so many students that are uh, in need of extra tutoring. And it's just it's the success ratio is phenomenal, guys. It, it really uh, so is. So nice to see what it did for Khalid. That's great. Yeah. yeah. Hey, Rosie, do you, what do you have? You can't take the fish off the hook by I, yourself? I, yeah. You know, I'm, I'm busy. I'm, I'm multitasking Let's here, Frank. See. Don't kill the fish. I'm not going to kill the fish. The <laughs> <room. Now laughs> I think it might be the same fish. I, I, I don't know. I think it's the same fish. I, I don't think. I think he's got an assistant. I don't think he knows how to take it off. Oh, I Have I Khalid do. take it off. He seems like a sharp <laughs> kid. We got pliers here. Oh, well, we're ready oh to go. Oh, my gosh. It's a sunny, isn't it? What is it's that? It's a bluegill. It's a bluegill. <laughs> Come on, Rosie. I didn't say that. Your wife did. <laughs> Here's All the right. point. The good point Thanks, is Rosie. <laughs> you can help students like Khalid. A lot of kids right now. All you need to do is call 1-800-542-WCCO. Or you can text GIVE to 612-324-0670. You can also donate online at WCCO.com. Thanks for the support. We'll be right back.